All right, setting the bar, Kelly. Examples of what not to do or situations we hope you don't find yourself in. Mm hmm. This criminal mastermind must have just forgotten this important step in his evil scheme. Okay. So if you can manage to make it through the day without robbing a gas station, then for forgetting to put gas in your car and running out of gas, you're doing okay. I'm sorry. The irony is kind of off the charts with this one. Yeah, it's kind of thick, isn't it? It's real thick. We're robbing a gas station, but we have no gas in the car. Yeah, Marcello Do drove we to... need to rob it first to pay for the gas? Well, he drove to the gas station early Friday morning, tried to rob the place. Woman working at the counter, 78 years old. She wasn't having any of it. She ducked under the oh. counter and hid. So wow. he panicked and bolted, drove off. Cops caught him uh, a little while later, and that's when his car ran out of gas. Oh, that is unfortunate. Yeah, he jumped... He didn't think to fill up first the getaway car. <laughs> I mean, if you're going to rob the place, wouldn't you think maybe, well, if I'm going to rob it anyways, might as well get a free tank of gas out of it. Maybe. Anyways. Yeah. uh, He like, what what was interesting about this entire thing is, you know, the gaslight would have been on for probably some time before he decided to do all this. Probably. Like he probably knew when he pulled up that he was running on running on fumes. fumes. Yeah. Yeah. Have you ever run out of gas? Yes. On my way to pick up my kids from daycare from Thurby. Oh, yeah. And I remember I'm you like, telling me I'm that story. I'm pushing it. I had to be there by 6 to pick them up. Otherwise, you, you have to pay. Yeah, to, you know, sure. The staff's got to stay late, and it's awful. I, I ran out of gas right next to another daycare <laughs> where my kids were not. Yeah. Pulled into the... And thank goodness... There was a dad picking up his kid at this daycare who offered to drive me down to the Thorntons nearby. I had to get a gas can, get the kid, yeah, get the gas can filled up that I had to buy and put in the car so I could get to daycare. And I, I think I was only five minutes late, but I, yeah, I'm calling him in a panic going, I run out of gas. I rely on the miles left to the tank indicator on my car way too much oh yeah now I, i've got a thing where i can hit a button and it'll tell me exactly how many cruising miles i have oh yeah yeah i mean I, I'm I, out. I leave it on that and so i'll i've gotten to under 10 and i'm like yeah i'm kind of pushing it <laughs> and, I'll, <laughs> and, I'll, and i'll go fill up but anyway uh, well then i'll put i'll pull up i'll pull up where i'm going on google maps how many miles is that mm-hmm. all right I'm going to make it with about two miles to spare. I can do it. I know. I can do it. I, and then I feel like when I do that, I've beaten the system. Yes. I don't know because why. Because you're using every bit of your purchase the I, last time you filled up. I guess. Yeah. All right. So again, setting the bar. I like to get my money's worth. If you can manage to make it through the day without robbing a gas station, then forgetting to actually put gas in your car and then running out of gas, you're doing okay. OMG. OMG. <laughs>